Lord, open our limbs, and we shall praise your name. Let all on earth their voices raise, re-echoing hands triumphant praise to him who gave the apostles grace to run on earth a glorious race. Thou at whose word they bore the light of gospel truth of heathen night to us that heavenly light impart to glad our eyes and cheer our heart. Thou at whose will to them was given to bind and loose in earth and heaven, our chains unbind, our sins undo, and in our hearts thy grace renew. Thou in whose might they spoke the word which cured disease and health restored to us its healing power prolong. Support the weak and firm the strong. Lord, let us see the Father, and then we shall be satisfied. Hallelujah. O oh God, you are my God, for you I long. For you my soul is thirsting. My body pines for you. Like a dry, weary land without water. So I gaze on you in the sanctuary to see your strength and your glory. For your love is better than life. My lips will speak your praise. So I will bless you all my life. In your name I will lift my hands. My soul shall be filled with a banquet. My mouth shall praise you with joy. On my bed I remember you. On you I muse through the night. For you have been my help. In the shadow of your wings I rejoice. My soul clings to you, your right hand holds me fast. Give praise to the Father Almighty, to his Son, Jesus Christ the Lord, to the Spirit who dwells in our hearts, both now and forever. Amen. Lord, let us see the Father, and then we shall be satisfied. Alleluia. Have I been with you all this time, and you still not, do not know me? Philip, to see me is to see the Father. Alleluia. O oh, all you works of the Lord, O oh, bless the Lord. To him be highest glory and praise forever. And you angels of the Lord, O oh, bless the Lord. To him be highest glory and praise forever. And you the heavens of the Lord, O oh, bless the Lord. And you clouds of the sky, O oh, bless the Lord. And you all armies of the Lord, O oh, bless the Lord. To him be highest glory and praise forever. And you sun and moon, O oh, bless the Lord. And you the stars of the heavens, O oh, bless the Lord. 
and you shall soon reign, O bless the Lord. To him be highest glory and praise forever. And you all you breezes and winds, O bless the Lord. And you fire and heat, O bless the Lord. And you cold and heat, O bless the Lord. To him be highest glory and praise forever. And you showers and dew, O bless the Lord. And you frost and cold, O bless the Lord. And you frost and snow, O bless the Lord. To him be highest glory and praise forever. And you night time and day, O bless the Lord. And you darkness and light, O bless the Lord. And you lightning and clouds, O bless the Lord. To him be highest glory and praise forever. O let the earth bless the Lord. To him be highest glory and praise forever. And you mountains and hills, O bless the Lord. And you all plants of the earth, O bless the Lord. And you fountains and springs, O bless the Lord. To him be highest glory and praise forever. And you rivers and seas, O bless the Lord. And you creatures of the sea, O bless the Lord. And you every bird in the sky, O bless the Lord. And you wild beasts and tame, O bless the Lord. To him be highest glory and praise forever. And you children of men, O bless the Lord. To him be highest glory and praise forever. O Israel, bless the Lord, O bless the Lord. And you priests of the Lord, O bless the Lord. And you servants of the Lord, O bless the Lord. To him be highest glory and praise forever. And you spirits and souls of the just, O bless the Lord. And you holy and humble of heart, O bless the Lord. Ananias, Azarias, Misael, O bless the Lord. To him be highest glory and praise forever. Let us praise the Father, the Son, and Holy Spirit. To you be highest glory and praise forever. May you be blessed, O Lord, in the heavens. To you be highest glory and praise forever. Have I been with you all this time, and you still do not know me? Philip, to see me is to see the Father. Alleluia. Do not let your hearts be troubled. Trust in God still and trust in me. There are many rooms in my Father's house. Alleluia. Sing a new song to the Lord. He's praised in the assembly of the faithful. Let Israel rejoice in its maker. Let sons sons exalt in their king. Let them praise his name with dancing and make music with timbrel and harp. For the Lord takes delight in his people. He crowns the poor with salvation. Let the faithful rejoice in their glory. Shout for joy and take their rest. Let the praise of God be on their lips, and a two-edged sword in their hand, to deal out vengeance to the nations, and punishment on all the peoples, to bind their kings in chains, and their nobles in fetters of iron. To carry out the sentence preordained, this honour is for all is faithful. Give praise to the Father Almighty, to His Son Jesus Christ the Lord, to the Spirit who dwells in our hearts, both now and for ever. Amen. Do not let your hearts be troubled. Trust in God still and trust in me. There are many rooms in my Father's house. Alleluia.
You are no longer aliens in a foreign land, but fellow citizens with God's people, members of God's household. You are built upon the foundation laid by the apostles and prophets, and Christ Jesus himself is the foundation stone. In him the whole building is bonded together and grows into a holy temple in the Lord. In him you too are being built with all the rest into a spiritual dwelling for God. You will make them rulers over all the land. Alleluia, Alleluia. You will make them rulers over all the land. Alleluia, Alleluia. Your name, Lord, will be remembered. You will make them rulers over all the land. Alleluia, Alleluia. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. You will make them rulers over all the land. Alleluia, Alleluia. Philip found Nathanael and said to him, We have found the one about whom Moses wrote in the law, and whom the prophets foretold. He is Jesus, son of Joseph, from Nazareth. Alleluia. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has visited his people and redeemed them. He has raised up for us a mighty Saviour in the house of David his servant, as he promised by the names of holy men, those who were his prophets from of old, a Saviour who would freeze from our foes, from the hands of all who hate us. So his love for our fathers is fulfilled, and his holy covenant remembered. He swore to Abraham our father, to grant us our tree from thee, and save from the hands of our foes, we might serve him in holiness and justice all the days of our life in his presence. As for you, little child, you shall be called a prophet of God the Most High. You shall go ahead of the Lord to prepare his ways before him to make known to his people their salvation through forgiveness of all their sins, the loving kindness of the heart of our God, who visits us like the dawn from on high. He will give light to those in darkness, those who dwell in the shadow of death, and guide us into the way of peace. Give praise to the Father Almighty, to His Son, Jesus Christ the Lord, to the Spirit who dwells in our hearts, both now and forever. Amen. Philip found Nathanael and said to him, We have found the one about whom Moses wrote in the law, and whom the prophets foretold. He is Jesus, son of Joseph from, from Nazareth. Alleluia. Since we have received from the apostles our heavenly inheritance, let us thank our Father for all his blessings. Lord the apostles, sing your praises. Praise to you, Lord God, for the gift of Christ's body and blood, handed on by the apostles, to give us strength and life. Lord, the apostles sing your praises. For the table of your word, served by the apostles, to bring us light and joy. Lord, the apostles sing your praises. 
for your holy church built on the apostles to make us all one body. Lord, the apostles sing your praises for the washing of baptism and penance entrusted to the apostles to cleanse our hearts from sin. Lord, the apostles sing your praises at the Saviour's command and formed by divine teaching we dare to say Our Father, who art in heaven hallowed be thy name thy kingdom come thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. Lord God, you give us the joy every year of celebrating the feast day of the Apostles Philip and James. Make us partners by their prayers in the passion and resurrection of your only begotten Son, so that we may come to the eternal vision of your glory. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. The Lord bless us and keep us from all evil and bring us to everlasting life. Amen.